bulls have been the most fascinating part of the shoot. The idea was to keep it very real and shoot most of the stuff with real animals. So to see these beautiful animals do stuff, it's just out of the world experience. Look at the wolf and action! kind of sequence you need to be thoroughly thoroughly planned you can't do it without any planning so we storyboarded it each and every shot was designed and the hindsight of it is that you don't know actually what you will get because by the end of it they're not humans doing it the most of the time the shot has animal so he's going to behave a certain way we gave Zoltan the complete brief so he trained with these wolves in his workshop in Budapest for almost two weeks and it was amazing because when they came on set, he actually knew exactly what we wanted. Bulls are coming, please step aside guys. Thanks. This is the first day of actions. I'm really waiting for it. Little thing about we start. Now you see that some of them are shy. Some of them are friendly. But we have a couple of, which are in the trailer at the moment which are not shy, which are not friendly, but they are vicious. Now there is one thing which is very important. As long as the wolf is free, so they are not on leash, and they are not in the cage, I'm in charge, nobody else. When I see the script first time, mm -hmm. I immediately knew that this is going to be really challenging because they will have to attack a kid who is only eight years old. I told the director, Ali, that we can only do this if they're going to get familiar with my kid. For example, this one, Nazon, he is really bad with kids and he would be the first who's attacking an eight years old boy. Obviously, when Nazon was on the set, Junior had to go and be locked in a safe place. But his brother, Dakota and Volko, they are just great with the kids. So I was confident when we arrived here to Austria, to Innsbruck, <laughs> that these guys are going to work together with Junior. I really like this guy. He was really brave. He did follow the, the instruction what I gave him, and uh, the wolf liked him. Let it down, and don't pull it, your, don't pull it away. The only rule to be around wolves is don't ever close your hands. Always open them like this and always let them sniff you because if you close your hand, they feel there's something in it and they might attack you. These guys are solving problems by themselves. They don't need your help. So you have to approach the training in a totally different way than you would do if you domesticated animals. They are ferocious, they're, they're all there. They're fierce animals. Treat them with a lot of respect and they will love you back. But one thing you should never forget these guys are wild animals, mm -hmm. and you gotta respect it. So you know your borders, how far you can go. The camera cannot see me, you wanna be in the camera all the time. You see this guy attacking a tiger, mm -hmm. and just before, he's, he has to show his teeth like this, mm -hmm. okay? So we figured we have to put a big piece of meat in front of him, mm -hmm. tied to the ground, and then I was just teasing him. He showed his teeth to the camera, it was just awesome, right? My favorite is Dakota. He's the pack leader. He's just too beautiful, very friendly. Nezon is the one who's the most naughtiest. He's the angry wolf. So all the angry shots of the wolf in the film is Nezon. He's the star performer. Uh, I just say that he's the real match to Salman Khan. There's one black one called Ida, who looks really ferocious, but, but is super cute. We have a great wolf, Shayo. You can go down with him on the ground and do some fights, but you gotta be careful with him mm -hmm. because he might be wishes with other people. So just for the safety reason, we have electric wires all around, just like in this camp. Mm -hmm. When we do the shooting with our wolves, we fence the whole set around with these wires. If I believe that he can do the job, uh, look at him, it's just beautiful. Then he will do the job. If I don't believe in my own animal, if I don't believe in myself, then nothing gonna happen. It was really great to work with Salman because um, 
We had some really difficult shots when uh, Salman is on the snowboard and he's going down and the camera car is in front of him and also camera on the top and the wolf had to run after him with a really high speed. Mm -hmm. We had to repeat this couple of times to get uh, the appropriate shot. He was really great. He loved the wolves. The, lo the wolves liked him. He's a straight guy. He is very natural and uh, they just got friend, uh, friendship immediately. The beauty of wolves is they hunt in a pack. When they get angry, uh, you feel a little scared of them. We thought when we came here, one person or the other will lose a hand. Up till now, no one has lost anything. And we are almost towards the last shots. It's been a good journey. They almost feel like a family. And hopefully, uh, it'll look beautiful on camera. Dakota. Hey, where are you going, Dakota? It has been a very challenging schedule. People falling, cameras falling, wolves running into you. All those things were fun. I think I think we all had great memories of it. And most of the crew have great selfies and uh, great pictures to show to their family. And um, and it's been fun. Ah!